Ricky here. Ignore the fact that I'm having like a major breakout session down here. Not really sure what the heck that's about, but yeah. So today we're gonna open this month's Ipsy bag. This is the bag. It's like a mesh, like weird material. Like, I don't know how I feel about it, but. So then inside we have this. It says, I will conquer with a line on it. And it says, fact, you've got this. Whether it's running a 5K, nailing a job interview, or a consistent skincare routine, everything you need to crush your 2018 goals is already within you. But since you could use all the help, but since we could all use a little extra motivation sometimes, your January glam bag, five personalized picks, and the articles on ipsy.com were designed to keep your game face keep you game-faced and ready for anything all month long. We even teamed up with Candace Huffton, Huffine of Day Slash One, an empowering activewear line to express that everybody and every... and everybody... everybody and everybody can slay every day. What will empower you? Fill in the blank on the flip side of this card. Post it on social media and chat tag Ipsy and Ipsy Game Face. Make sure you cheer on other Ipsters too. Let's reach our goals together. P.S. Looking for even more beauty fuel? Head to Ipsy Shopper and load up your on your faves and get 10 to 30% off cash back everything you buy. But that really says everybody and everybody right there. Everybody and everybody. Not really sure about that. So that's what the card says. Um, so then inside, we have five products. Um, I'm going to go with this one first. This is a Perlis Blue Lotus Scene Mud Mask Exfoliating Gentle Gently resurf resurfaces, detoxifies, brightens, tightens, and smooths. It's a 10-minute facial. Um, it says, Blue Lotus Extract is a powerful antioxidant. White clay purifies pores. Bamboo gently exfoliates. Ginger detoxifies. Mushroom brightens skin. White tea soothes skin. Rice brand water promotes clarity. Start with a cleansed skin. Apply a thin layer to face, neck, and chest. Set and dry for 10 to 15 minutes. Remove mask with water in gentle circular motions. Use two to three times a week. So that's a pretty good size for a mud mask. You shouldn't have to use much of it at all. And it's sealed, so that's a good thing. Um, I was gonna see if it smelled. No, there's not really a smell to it. So that'll be interesting to try. Next thing, I'm just going to reach in. Here we go. This is the Bella Pierre Cosmetics Stay Put Brow Gel. I'm not sure how this is going to go because I don't know if... So it's got a little brush thing up here. But I don't know if... It's a little sketchy for them to send you. Not sketchy, like bad sketchy, but like really risky to send you brow products in the mail because nobody knows what color you use. This is in cardamom is what it says. So that's what it looks like. That's a very light swatch. But yeah, so I will test that out. It's very tiny, but I feel like it's going to go a long way. So I will test that out and let you all know. I'm going to test these products out, and then I'm going to do a comparison uh, video with Birchbox in a separate video. But I'm going to remind you of my Birchbox finds, or my Birchbox thing in this video. This is the Mary Luminizer. The Luminizer... AKA the Luminizer. And it's just a highlighter from the balm. And I'm in love with this packaging. Let's see. Oh my goodness, that's gorgeous. I don't think you'll be able to see it, but it is 
a very golden highlight. So I'm really excited to try that out. Okay, this is not gonna, I'm not gonna wear this. Lips, liquid lipstick in matte rouge, kissable in mad about mauve. I'm not gonna wear this. I can already tell you that. Yeah, no, there's no way. Um, there's no way I would even put this on my lips. So it's that color. I wonder how close it is to, oh, they're way off, but I could probably pair these two together. I just don't know. I'm gonna put this on and see like if I can pull it off. No, I won't wear this. This will not get worn. I'm just like being honest with you. <laughs> Unless I can figure out a way to wear it that it doesn't uh look so dark that won't get worn and i said i don't like colors like that so i'm not really sure what ipsy was thinking last product in here is this preventative measures 101 after hours lip balm with moisture release technology in passion fruit which i'm going to put some of this on right now because my lips are so freaking chapped which is also probably another reason why um, um, that lipstick did not look good. Mm. Super moisturizing and it smells amazing. So anyway, so that was everything in this month's Ipsy bag. Um, I'm excited about everything except this. Like, I will, will probably will not wear this. I might, maybe. It depends on if I can blend it out or not. Um, yeah, see, it's even like too dark when I when I blend it. Yeah, I I just don't see myself wearing that. But I will test everything out and give it a go. So we got this, some brow gel, some chopstick, a mud mask, and a highlighter. And in Birch Box, we got a fortifying uh, eyelash primer. A um, this is a age-defying radiance cream. And we got a Smashbox photo finish foundation primer and then we have the Oribe Gold Lust Repair and Restore Conditioner and Shampoo. So I will be reviewing all of these products and comparing them um, at a later date. I can review some of the Birch Box items. These I wasn't impressed with. This is giving me one and a half uses. I have about a half a use left in this one which means I will have to once again, um, pair it with my other shampoo in order to get anything out of these. So, not too happy about that. This is okay. I haven't noticed it doing much for my skin. Um, so, I'm still testing it out, though. Um, I didn't notice any difference with this. Uh, I didn't notice any difference. I don't know if I need to use more or what. This I loved. This I was really impressed with. So, I will go into more depth reviews when I compare them, but um, I was a little bit more impressed with one rather than the other, but, you know, we'll see how it plays out. Um, Alright, I love you guys, and I will see you next time. Bye!